Good morning, Kingdom Kids. It's Pastor Leslie. Today is Mother's Day. Woohoo! I hope you're celebrating your moms today. I hope you're loving on them. Cook for them, clean for them, make a dessert, make a car, do something special for your moms. They deserve that and so much more every day, not just today. You all, we are in the Beatitudes. And what do the Beatitudes mean? It just means blessed or happy. And Matthew, who was a disciple of Jesus, he recorded Jesus' words in Matthew chapter 5, verse 5. And what does that say? It says, blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Now, kingdom kids what does meek mean meek just means being humble gentle or kind i want you all to know that jesus is meek jesus is gentle that does not mean that we're supposed to be weak you know i think a lot of times we think when we don't respond to arguments or we don't get in fights or we uh just be the bigger person and be kind to people who are mean to us a lot of times we think that we're being weak but no jesus is not weak jesus um got people told jesus was flipping over tables in the temple so it doesn't mean that we're supposed to be weak but it means that we are under god's power that we're submitting all of our strength and all of our power to god and god is working through us we're not taking matters into our own hands you all i want to tell you all a story moses in the old testament in numbers chapter 12 verse 3 the bible says that moses was the most humble man in all the earth now that's huge now moses had two siblings miriam and um aaron and they were talking about him, y'all. And they were talking about his wife. And Moses, I don't think he responded because the Bible says he was the most humble man on the earth after they record that um, his siblings were talking about him. And a lot of times being meek just means that we're not going to use what we could use in a situation. For instance, if someone writes something um, bad on your social media, if someone says something um, that's not true about you, what would it look like to be gentle, to be kind, to be patient during that time? Now, I know it's hard. Some of y'all are like, Pastor Leslie, you are tripping. And I know you all, it's so hard to not respond how we would want to in those situations. But let me tell you something. The Bible says that vengeance is the Lord. What does vengeance mean? It just means payback. Payback is God's, is God's uh, uh, job. We don't have to worry about that. God is going to take care of the people that do us wrong. He sees it. He did not miss anything. He does not miss anything. So I want you all to know that payback is God's job. Leave it to God. But even that Mary, Jesus' mother, She's described as being humble. She writes a song in Luke chapter one, and she says, you have remembered the state of your humble servant. Talking about herself, Mary was humble, you all. You all, if we want to be happy, if we want to please God, we need to be meek. We need to be gentle, humble, and kind. So this week, what would it look like for you to be kind to your siblings? What would it look like for you to be kind to your parents, to be gentle with those who get on your nerves? Maybe it's a friend. Maybe it's a cousin. You all, we have the job to be nice, to be kind to the people around us. So Kingdom Kids, I love you and I'm trusting you and I'm counting on you to do this. Have a great week and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.